don't have this place memorized. Well, me not memorized to the point where I can't look at the map, but I know where I'm going. Down south, yeah, okay. Oh, it's shit if I can mount in here. I didn't think so. <laughs> I'll be like, I've been running this whole time. Two weeks still. Good. Good, good, good. Isn't this ready to go, right? Yeah. Thought there was a barrier up here. Like I had to get rid of a barrier or something. Or is that oh no, that's over there. Never mind. Well, hopefully, um No, that's where I need to go, isn't it? That's where the magicite is. Isn't it? I think so. There's like a barrier that I have to get past to get the magicite. I'm pretty sure it's the other one. It's just been so long since I've done this quest. Nope. Not the right way. Damn. No, wait. Uh, what am I doing? I have to go through there. Come out there in the middle island. And then that's how I get to... Okay. Yeah. It, it's coming back to me. It's been a while. So I do have to go in here, run through here, zone back out into the void, and then zone back in where that barrier is. Ugh. Can I not spectral jig? Oh yeah, maybe it's just because I zoned. I don't feel like dealing with aggro, so. So yeah, the magicite. Okay. Watch me still be going to the wrong place for the Magicite. That's very possible, too. Because if the Magicite's in that top left, I'm definitely going to the wrong spot. I think it might be in that top left of this map. That's okay, I'll figure it out once I get back outside. Oh, 
All right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to just double check everything. I'm guessing, trying to go off memory, and it's, I'm just wasting time by doing that. So, Devoy. Alright, so it says G7. So it is the top. Okay, it is the top up there. According to Wiki, I gotta go to G7. So I was going to the wrong entrance. Um, that entrance was for a different mission. Yeah. Can't fall off here. I can fall off here, I think. Okay, so yeah, it was the top left of that map. Where I was going was where the bit the NM spawns, like the orc what is it, the Orcish Warlord or something? That's okay. I know where I'm going now. Okay, so this is it. So there is still a wall of dark arts here. Alright. Do I not have the orb? <laughs> oh my god. I thought I did this before and I got the orb. Like, months ago. Oh, facepalm. Well then. Do I have, have I started the orb quest? Maybe I have. Fail badge, yeah. So I have a Yugudo torch, which is for the Yugudo portion of this. I have the silver bell. I have the... Cor like, those three things right there are for... Yeah, Crimson Orb. Is that not the one I need? Now has the power to break the seal at the far end of Devoy. Isn't that what I need, the Crimson Orb? Wall of Dark Arts is not letting me, it's not letting me through, but I have the Crimson Orb. I'm not sure what I'm missing, why I can't get through this wall of dark arts. The 
crimson orb is that for the oh maybe it was a different wall wall of banishing how do we get through the wall of dark hearts Yeah, this literally literally just says click on the click on the thing and go through, which it's not working. Um, okay, it's not the right key item, dude. I'm like so doing this wrong. Every everything I try to do is just like, no, you've skipped something. No, you've skipped something. No, you skipped something. <laughs> okay, I've got the Yugudo torch for the Yugudo portion. I have the Coruscant rosary and the black matinee necklace. So I have those two. I never did the Devoy part, which is the crest of Devoy. I need the crest of Devoy to get past this. I thought it was the crimson orb. The crimson orb is for the other wall, on the other side of Devoy not this wall so yeah i literally when i did this the first time ever it was 2005 and it's the only time i've ever done this quest and i was basically pulled through it i didn't have the key items or anything so yeah i didn't know any better um so i'm blaming that that's fine <laughs> I gotta do it. We're gonna go. I gotta go to Upper Juno. Trade an NPC coral meat. And then I get the Crest of the Void. That's it. That's all I had to do. Okay. Fine. I, I might even have coral meat because I was killing corals earlier. check and see real fast uh if not i'll just buy it off the auction house whatever no cockatrice meat i don't have coral meat all those quarrels i fought oh maybe my inventory was full the entire time i was fighting those quarrels yeah hopefully there's some on the auction house Upper? Upper Juno? Yes, upper. Uh, G8. No, I want to go near the auction house. I gotta buy stuff. So that put me about 15 minutes behind. Um, first going the wrong way, and then realizing I don't have the right key item. So that's fun. <laughs> uh, is it under ingredients? No, it should be under meats, right? That's meals. It's not fish. It's not a meal. It's got to be ingredients. I just thought there was like a, a meats. Come on, I want to sort. Alright, coral meat. Here we go. Price history. 30k. Ooh. Just for one piece of meat. Try to buy it for 10. There were 10 on there, to be fair. I know I was being cheap, but look. On 315, 10k, 9.5, 10 so, you can't blame me for trying for 10k. That's going to be... 30. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, this guy's at G8. 
I'm at G9, so and his name is starts with a B. Is he in a house? I don't know if he's in a house or not. Um, no. No. This is G8. He could be in the top right corner in that building, which is the weapons shop. Or he could be in this other house in the corner. Oh no, it's this guy right here, this little kid. Yes, I am heading to the void, thank you. I do need a crest of the void. Why, that's exactly what I need. Here, here's your meat. It's 30k. Oh, is I trading it to the door? <laughs> uh, no, I was trading it to him. He's just being... It's like he's pretending I'm not here now because I refused, I guess. I clicked too fast. I am heading to Void, yes. Yeah, I do need that crest. What do you say? See, the, it auto... Not right now. Sure, yeah. So it basically auto-turned down the quest at first. That's why I couldn't trade him. Okay. <laughs> it's me, remember? Say, <laughs> like, I'm your brother, remember me? All right, come on. Just want to get to Devoy. Had I realized that's all I had to do to get a crest of Devoy, and that I needed a crest of Devoy, auto got this yesterday when I was doing my dance request because it was right there. Like, if I could turn my camera around, right, right there. All right, let's try again. I still, f I still feel like I got the Kulin Dome Magicite. I don't know why. I feel like I've been there and I got it. Unless I wasn't on the quest yet when I went there. I don't remember. I'll probably go back anyway, um, just to make sure. No, wrong one. All right, I know where I'm going now, at least. We'll go... Yeah. I don't have my run speed anymore. This isn't a very, very long run, so I'm not even going to stop for it. Yeah, um, for some reason these magic this Magicite quest, I don't know why I was thinking it was as bad as the the crest, where you had to get like the Yagudo crest and the Orcish crest and the 
uh, Quadav Crest. That one sucked worse than this because it, this is a lot closer and an easier run. What mission was that for? Getting those crests. Oh, that was a level cap quest. Yeah, to, to break your level cap. And that's what the Crimson Orb was, were, was for, was back when I was doing, like, level 60 or 65. So that makes sense. I don't remember this. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember that at all. Okay. All right, I think I'm going to go get uh which one am I going to go get next? Probably Castle Ostrosa. I still feel like I got the Budo one. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is leading them to, like, the, what is it, Norvalen, the Northlands, because rank 5, 5-1 five and 5-2, you have to come up here and uh, eventually fight Shadow Lord, so. Then Zarkabard. Yep. 
Castles of All, what is it, Castles of All Bales or something like that? I forget what it's called. Alright, so let me check that key item real quick. Let's find out where it is. Yeah, there it is. Was I overlooking it the whole time? I did have, I do have two Magicite. I thought I had two of them. Okay, so I just need Castle, what is it, Castle Ostroza? Ostroja? Castle Ostroja? That's all I need. Um, so that's Devoy. And that's Budeau. I knew I had Budeau. Okay, awesome. So that will save some time. Even though I got backtracked a little bit because I didn't have the Devoy Crest or Devoy, what was it? Whatever the key was to get into here. I don't have to do Budeau. Awesome. Alright, fastest way to Castle Ostroza. Ostroja. Um, same way I got to Devoy, that little book. And I hope I have a map of Ostroja because I don't remember the zone well enough to do it without a map. Okay, um, hmm. Mm, uh, nope. There it is. All right. First question is, do I have a map? I do. Awesome. Uh, now getting to the Magicite. Okay. Yeah, it's going... It 
really shouldn't be very far in. I'm pretty sure Magicite for all three of these places isn't extremely deep. Um, Oh, good. I didn't hit the trap door. Awesome. There's a trap door there if you pull the wrong lever. <laughs> okay. Now, this is not this is where I don't know where to go. Uh, second floor, head to G7. Or exit into a courtyard. Okay. Not on the second map yet. Alright. Where's... Oh. I guess I can check. Is that all the way around the other side? Hold up. G7, yeah. Can I get to it by going north? I think so. I think that's the way I have to go. Yeah, this looks right. Okay. I gotta go. I think NM's an NM spawns in here on the bottom floor. I don't remember the name of the NM though. If we do a little wide scan, maybe I can just check. No. Nope. Okay, we'll go this way. I'm pretty sure, let me just check the map, I'm pretty sure that I won't have anywhere to go but one way. Um, yes, I think it's bottom down there at, hold up, isn't it all the way down there at the bottom? G10, is that where we're going to go? Maybe not. Maybe it's in that middle room. Hold on. Let me read this. Yeah, okay. It is that middle room. Cool. Glad I checked. Trying to do this off memory. I am not doing it right.
So once I get this done, once I get past Shadow Lord, I'll be able to continue my Rhapsody's missions, as well as since I'll be rank 6, I can start doing Xylart missions. Um, earlier I mentioned I would love to start Xylart missions tomorrow night, which means I would have to get past Shadow Lord before then. Um, so that might be something I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get past Shadow Lord tonight, time pending. If I don't, then that'll be the first thing I do tomorrow, and then either start on Rise of the Xylart or continue Rhapsodies. So, yeah. Got some. Now that I'm 99, I'm just going to be grinding out some missions, trying to get a little bit farther into that. Uh, yeah, over here, that's right. Now, I already have the torch, I already checked, so I know I'm not going to go into this and be like, oh, I can't get past the door like I did in Devoy. What level are these guys? Isn't this where I need to go? Brass statue, is that right? Or am I going the wrong way again? No, that's the <laughs> that's the that's the password. That's the second word. Oh, that's all the way down here. It said H nine. Isn't that where I'm at? Am I am I at H nine right now? I'm in H nine. So you reach the door at H nine. I'm at H9. Odd. Very odd. Maybe it's a different part of H9. What other part of H9 is there? That southwest corner of H9? Look at me going the wrong way again. Okay. Uh, the other part of H9 is down here, so... If this isn't it, I'm going to be stumped, to be honest. I'll have to backtrack and figure out what's going on. Okay, here's a, here we go. This brass door. I was at the wrong door. Cannot reach. What? I'm right on, I'm right on it. Okay. That was the brass door at H9. I was in H9. I did what it said. I just thought it was in the middle. Okay. Zone. Cutscene is what it seems like. Yep. Thick Blix. What kind of name is that? Do you have a Peridot by chance, Thick Blix? I need to get my Gobby bag bigger. Oh no, Fickblix died. Yeah, so this one is definitely the farthest away Magicite. Um, I don't think the Yuguda Torch, if I remember, was very hard to get. But in terms of entrance to Magicite, this one's the farthest away. 
based on me just doing Devoy and me remembering where the Budo one is. Budo is pretty close to the entrance as well. Um, so yeah, this one takes the longest to get to once you enter like Castle Ostrosa. So since I already have the Budo Magisite, I'm not going to see that cutscene. Um, I think it's probably in a YouTube video I have somewhere. Don't know which one. <laughs> oh, damn, he's just running through. Right. There we go. Kind of hoping I can get to that tonight. But I'm done with Magic Sight, so that is good. Um, just go turn it in, and then I should be able to start rank 5-1. Uh, yeah, let me go turn this in, and then I can start the next mission, the next rank mission.
Okay. I think it's here first. Oh yeah, airship pass. Did I not have one? I guess now with the teleports and stuff, I haven't needed one. It's kind of odd saying I didn't have an airship pass and I'm level 99. But the way travel is now in the game with just teleport, the crystal teleports, you don't really need an air pass. Or an airship pass, whatever. Yeah, they seek to resurrect the Shadow Lord. Sweet. One more thing to do here in Rulu Gardens, which should complete the rank 4 to rank 5. He has him still rank 4. Um, should be here. What is this place called again? Uh, the Embassy. Yeah, I think it's in the Embassy. I don't remember who to talk to. Oh, it was him. I thought maybe I had to go through the <laughs> door over there. Awesome. Ten K in message to Juno. Is it to Juno or from Juno? Oh, no. They sent a message to Juno saying, hey, we're in trouble. Got it. Message to Juno. Alright. I don't think my warp rings up. That's fine. I can just go out and use a crystal. Do I need to uh, up my bar? Oh, no. It's already up a little bit. Okay. Didn't know if I needed to max out that little rank XP bar or not. Hopefully I don't need to. Turn this up just a little bit. Oh, 
think you can get Kirilla as a trust, I think. Do I already have her? So there was a talisman that kept Shadow Lord imprisoned, and they came and got it. That figures. says I have to talk to Halver, so let me go and talk to him real quick. And that's not what I needed. I don't need my um, Ot Ergen badge. <laughs> talk to you again. <laughs> how, many, how many different things does he have for me? Talk to him three separate times just to get this. I honestly don't know if this is part of rank 5 or not, or if this is something different. Because he's talking about getting a new queen. And I don't think that's part of rank 5 mission, but maybe it is. I, I, did, I don't know. Okay. I'm going to talk to Halver again after this just to make sure he doesn't have anything else to say. Because it's very possible he had like three or four quests backed up on him and I just didn't talk to him to do those. Oh. <sighs> Yeah, this is talking for about Prince Tryon's bride. And I really don't think this is part of the rank 5 mission. I... Yeah, so... <laughs> I guess I have to accept this. Playing matchmaker. 
whatever that's for. Let me talk to you again. All right, hopefully that's it. Hopefully I don't have to do anything else because he's asking about the uh, playing matchmaker thing now. So if I still can't get the quest, then I hope I don't have to do that first. I really don't, don't want to. I think that was just something extra. Alright, so apparently a gate guard will give me the mission. So it should be this guy. What's this called? Is it, is it called the Ruins of Feyen? I think it is. I believe that's the correct quest. Sounds right, actually. Yeah, so I think I have to go fight a bunch of skeletons out there in Feyen in a BCNM fight. I don't know if I have a teleport to Feiyin or not. I hope I do. If not, I know I, I know I have a teleport either with the book or the crystal to uh, Busidin Glacier. Okay. Um, so I have a little guide up just to make sure I don't skip anything because I've wasted a lot of time trying to do this by memory and this is something I don't remember either. So it said, make sure to go back to Halver to get a key item before you proceed. So hopefully Halver doesn't ask about Tryon's bride and gives me the key item. <clears throat> Before you ask, no, I haven't found that Elvin. But give me the key item, please. Yeah, this this looks like the correct dialogue. <laughs> Yeah, I'm leaving. On a jet plane. Okay, um, I'm actually going to check to see if I have a, do I have other crystal, 
think there's teleport crystals out there to, to fade in. Um, I don't know if I have one. Guess not. I've been out there, though. And I know I've been... to the outposts. And the outposts have the books, right? Yeah. Okay, I think I have those. I think I have the book, which is fine. Because I had to go out there to do level cap, like level 50 or 55 in Zarkabard. So I know I've been to the outpost and clicked on the book. I know it. Oh, I drank my water wrong. Oh, I hate when I do that. <clears throat> okay. Norvalen. There it is. No, it's not Norvalen. Um, Aragonel. That's it. No, it's not. I'm getting all these wrong. There we go. Jeez. Third time's a charm. Okay, let's see if I have a map. I do. Awesome. I kind of remember where to go, though. Actually, I 100% remember where to go here. I don't need a map. so funny like my legs are straight on this crab I can't really get a good shot of it but I think it looks so funny <laughs> I want to get more mounts um, I really don't know how to get more mounts except for the login campaigns I don't know of any other mounts to get I haven't done any research on it though, so I'm sure once I start looking into it, I can figure them out. But yeah, I only have this in the raptor right now. I remember farming Dynamis spew sitting out here trying to get my Aegis shield on my paladin. That took a while. Uh, I remember doing this back when there weren't mounts, 
and just the run took forever. Like, the map doesn't look too big, but running you had to run along the cliffs and go down each little ramp and back and forth, back and forth. This is actually, because of that, this is a huge zone because of how long it takes to get from one side to the other. There it is. Almost there. You can see it. <clears throat> I still feel like I got some of that water stuck in my throat when I swallowed it wrong. Whew. Okay, now here, oh, well, cutscene. Another area I don't remember where to go. Okay, this cutscene. Okay. See, I gotta go to get this up. K8. Do I have a map up here? I do. <laughs> Gosh. I'm surprising myself with these maps, to be honest. K all the way over there. Eight. So it's basically just going as far east as I can. Oh, I see the crystal. You see that crystal glowing right there at K8? I thought I had that crystal. And that's what I was looking for for a fast teleport. Because that crystal's where I gotta go. Yeah, okay. Alright, cool. Uh, just in case there's aggro, I don't want to aggro. Is there not a floating book here? Like, I know there's this one, but one that's bouncing? Like, a bouncing book means I can teleport here through the book. I don't see one. Okay, that's fine. I thought I came here before on this character, but maybe not. Maybe I was here on my main character back when I was had both accounts active at the same time. I just got it mixed up. Very possible. Okay. Make 
sure I know which way to go. Here should be the right door. Straight ahead, right? Nope. Give it a go this way. Almost there. Okay. I don't know if these things would aggro. They're incredibly easy prey, so sometimes easy prey does aggro. I don't feel like fighting anything. I just want to get through it. So I'm running short on time. I don't know if I'm going to get to Shadow Lord tonight or not. Would like to. So I'm trying to get through this as quickly as I can. Just in case I do have time. There we go. Here's the crystal. New home point. Alright. Shouldn't be hard. I think these. This is a. This used to be a level 55 cap. I think a while back. Um, it's not capped anymore. So level 99. It's going to be the cakewalk. Um, but yeah, this used to be a 55 cap. That was. That was when you needed strategy and the right party setup and all that. But now it's just meh. make it even easier records 41 seconds they probably didn't even take time to summon stuff just went in and killed like no trusts it's already been 41 seconds <laughs> it took me 41 seconds to get all my trusts out Oh, you only have to kill that one? I'm glad that's who I went for. I didn't read that. I thought you had to kill them all. I just went for the big one. Well, that's nice. Castle's Vault. Oh, yeah. There's a Castle's Vault and then the Castle Keep. Like, there's two different zones for that. To get to the Shadow Lord. That's right. I remember. I remember it used to take a while to get through it. Hopefully, it won't take too long now since I can pretty much skip fighting. Should be pretty easy to get to the top. Um, so this is going to be it for this mission, uh, be able to talk to Halver, complete it, 
And then the next mission is the Shadow Lord mission. So, yeah, getting there. Getting things done that I put off for a long time. I was like, oh, I'll do that later, I'll do that later. I'd rather level, I'd rather do this, I'd rather unlock that. When in reality, this should have been done a while ago. I should have already had Sky unlocked on this character. I should have, yeah. I haven't even started Xylark because I haven't been high enough rank. <clears throat> but hopefully that changes tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm, unless I decide to do something else on the fly, I'm planning on doing Rise of the Xylark missions tomorrow. But again, that's I could change my mind. Maybe I'll do Rhapsodies. I don't know because doing Rhapsodies would mean I'd get to summon. Once I get far enough, I'd get to summon my... Uh, fifth trust and that's pretty helpful too so it's gonna be one of those two things tomorrow for sure rhapsodies or xylart or both depends on how much time i have i guess i remember like in 2009 2010 i was uh running a guild and it was a, a primarily sky guild we spent a majority of our time in skies and new members didn't have sky unlocked so, like, twice a week, I take, like, five or six hours in one day, tell everybody, okay, get to rank six, and then we'll start from mission one and go all the way through and unlock Sky for you in one go. And we do it in, like, five or six hours. Um, and that was with me pulling people through, them not knowing where to go, at 75 caps, so we had to fight stuff, couldn't skip anything. So I'm thinking I can maybe do Xylart missions... Unless, I don't remember if there was any, um, wait till, oh, excuse me, if there was wait till reset, wait till the next day kind of thing. If there's not, because I don't remember, if it's just, okay, go here, do this, go here, do that. I'm wondering if I can get it done in like three or four hours and get Sky unlocked. That might be something I can try. I totally didn't read any of that. <laughs> okay. All right, so that's that mission. Next thing I'm going to do is um, I'm going to start the Shadow Lord quest. I don't know how long or how far I'm going to get into it. I'd like to finish it. Um, but give me just a second, and I'm going to start that. I'm going to go stretch for just a second. I'll be right back. <laughs> 